So now I have that 50 milliliters of the air sample pulled from the salamander chamber and it's set up into the specialized thing that's called a syringe pump. And this is going to pump the air sample through the system and effectively do the same thing as I showed you previously, but now we're pushing a sample through rather than pulling it through. So it's going to go through all that same machinery and the rate of oxygen consumption is highly dependent on the rate at which it passes, the air sample passes through the system. So we need to control this. We can't just push it through with our hands because that could affect the, the percentage of oxygen as we change speeds pushing it through. So this syringe pump allows us to pump through at a very specific rate that we could measure and then build that into our calculations and look at the percentage of oxygen in there. So I'm gonna start this. You can see right here, very slowly, but surely, that pump is pushing oxygen through. You can see that sample moving, it was previously at 50. And then what we would be able to do is once this machine is specially calibrated for this particular sample, check our flow rate, I'll show you here our flow rate. So we're at 0 0.20, much slower than what it was being pulled at previously. And what we could do is we could look at the screen and we could actually take a look at the sample that's being taken or the sample that's being pushed through this, this system. So the data that I'll show you for this um, particular sample is just a readout same same values that we saw before but just being pushed through from a closed circuit sample rather than being pulled through